today we will discuss about in this lesson how to configure a google provider on my first portal so first we will go to the power apps and click apps from left navigation and select my first portal and then click setting there are so many times we will go to portal setting so advanced option authentication setting there are authentication setting link so we click this link And there are so many provider already enabled Facebook and LinkedIn. So now we will configure a go Google. So then click three dot and configure. So configure identity provider. Uh, this is the display. Okay, and click next. And now we will go to create Google app. So how to create a app now we will go to the google cloud okay google cloud yay this is the google cloud link https console do developers dot google dot com <laughs> okay uh, this is the dashboard and now we will click hamburger icon and then go to go to go to go to go to go to api api services this is our api services and now enable apis and services and search google 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 pupil api api enter Go to Google Pupil API Manage and now click credential credential. and create a credential authentication client id select web application and change the name of web client uh, power 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 that's it and authorize javascript power 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 and authorize javascript and uri now copy that and paste it here not need to sign in okay and now authorized redirect uri 
url control v this is the complete url copy that and now create okay this is our client id copy this id and paste it client id and copy that your secret id and paste it here click confirm okay configure google setting is ready ready google is enabled okay that's it the lesson